wages stolen, intimidation, violence, and picketing, and rallies, and delegations, and vigils with the support of all of our community and the labor movement. Workers at the period car washes will finally see some justice. So on Friday afternoon, the notorious brothers, the Perian brothers, who actually have become the face, the symbol, because they themselves do not commit all of the injustices in the car wash industry, but they are the face of the most abusive and unrepentant owners in the car wash industry. They actually pled no contest to criminal charges, and they were sentenced to 365 days in county jail, not counting, and in addition, the financial restitution that they will have to pay to the workers. So today, today we put on notice that this struggle, it's taken a little over two years, put on notice that it's a new day in the car wash industry in the county of Los Angeles. And I'm so proud that Los Angeles Union have stood by the car wash workers since this campaign was first announced in March of 2008. You have here today, for example, the stagehands, IATSC unions, who together with Unite Here hotel workers, iron workers, steel workers, laborers, service employees, uh, Screen Actors Guild, all of which participated in these picket lines. They also helped to pass California's car wash worker law. Uh, labor has turned out in the hundreds. We were here with our national president, John Sweeney, of the AFL-CIO. When first uh, charges were first filed, uh, criminal charges by then city attorney Rocky Delgadillo. Um, and the labor movement raised about $75,000 from a number of unions, including IBEW, AFSCME, Teamsters, the food and commercial workers, communications workers, all to help the workers who have the courage to stand up to these employers and say, ya basta, enough is enough. We were proud to be here to be able to do all of that. And the real heroes are our sisters and brothers Car washeros. They are the heroes. Imagine the sacrifice and the courage that it takes to stand up to those who are saying, like the Perian brothers, they would rather, those employers would rather go to jail than to treat these workers with respect. Well, think about it again, because you are going to jail. not only to the car wash industry, but throughout all low-wage industries. That this kind of abuse will not be tolerated in Los Angeles, and the resources, the community, we're all going to be there to back up the workers. Si se puede! Se puede! Si se puede! No más quiero decir brevemente por parte del movimiento laboral que nosotros orgullosamente hemos estado al lado de los car washeros desde que se anunció esta campaña un poco más de dos años. Ellos son los verdaderos héroes. Ellos son los que aguantaron las amenazas, la violencia, la, uh, que les robaron sus sueldos. Todas esas injusticias. Hoy hay un poco de justicia por ellos. Ellos son los héroes. Y vamos a seguir apoyándoles hasta que ganen todo lo que es justo para ellos y sus familias. También queremos que este sea un mensaje en otras industrias que tratan de abusar o abusan de los trabajadores inmigrantes, tengan o no tengan papeles. Este movimiento sindical va a estar a su lado hasta que todos, si ellos prefieren, los empleadores, ir a la cárcel, que vayan a la cárcel junto con estos hermanos. Gracias.